وحن صدقنا يا وفدي يا وجامنا يسي كحجين كأسر جيجا ويكمل دعيان مدحة باستر مدرة أيودا يو باستر كأيودا يو إيجت رنتي وحن وجمع هذا علنا يا سفر كان نقول ما هذا المجال الجروة إن حلقي جب جبدو وها دور شوين كي هير فدر عليه كسعودي استديا دا أو أي معلم يركع هرين وقتي لو أستي إن لبسه جب جبيو إن رنتي كلن كان وحوها كلن إن أنا جاود هذا إن هير كا ومرايو ديار جروجي مرحلة ده اللي بعد دور شوين كا إن مركي جب جبودو يجودهان حالة الدلك مرحلة دان عمر أيوة يعقب هذا دمن هاد كجرة سيد لو جاري لها سيد لو دم يصير لها إلكشن كا لو نجاري لها دمن حيابي لجوه شيء وكم ديهين قوم ضد هوانك لو نجاري لها وقتي لو قط على جلي مركا كل الناس حق ورئيسها أيو حق جيسها حيابي وبنا عن كابو هذا المنا وحين نقدم حيابي رنتي أنا سلقة رناي وأنا وما هذا علينا يا رنتي سفر كان قاتي وقت يكوها بنا. Thank you, President Said Abdullah Denny, and your team for the warm welcome that you have extended to us today as the AU, the EU, EGAD, and the UN. It is a pleasure to be back in Garoway on one of our regular visits to the federal member states and as part of our collective effort to support Somalia on its path to greater stability. I'm accompanied by the special representative of the chairperson of the African Union Commission, Ambassador Madeira, his deputy, Fiona Lawton, the ambassador of the EU to Somalia, Tina Intelman, and a representative of the EGAD Special Mission to Somalia, Mr. Ibrahim Mohamed Abdi. In our meeting today with the President and his Cabinet, we discussed issues of local and national concern with a particular focus on the current elections. We spoke, we heard from the President about the current drought and his concerns and how we need to work together moving forward. We spoke about the urgency of moving to the next stage of elections and the actions required to do so. We welcome the progress in Puntland towards the completion of the House of the People elections by the deadline of the 15th of March. So far, Puntland has elected 31 out of 37 seats, of which five are women. Again, we underline the fundamental importance of inclusivity of the process. We applauded the vibrant advocacy efforts in Puntland towards achieving the minimum quota of 30% women's representation in Parliament. However, we noted with concern that achievement of this objective is in doubt. We therefore urge that ongoing efforts be redoubled to ensure more women's representation in the federal parliament. As we approach the 15th of March deadline, it is important to conclude elections for all House of the People seats at the earliest. We therefore urge stakeholders to work together constructively and expeditiously while ensuring political space for all so that the electoral process can be completed by the agreed deadline. I thank you, Mr. President. I thank your government. And most importantly, we thank the people of Puntland for their very warm welcome. Thank you very much. <laughs>